not dead. When we rehydrated it with normal saline, 72 hours of body temperature with slight, very gentle swirling, and put the white blood cells in a growth medium, 48 hours later, we did a chromosome count. I didn't. This was in Israel. It has 24 chromosomes only. All of us here have 46. Unless, you know, we have, there's a couple of genetic uh, anomalies that make that different. But Christ received 23 from his mother and one Y, sex determining factor from his father who was not a human father. Because had he received that from a human father, it would have been accompanied by 22 autosomes. Now what this basically means is that his height, his eye color, his hair color, and all of this was supplied from the genes of his mother's gene pool. However, Mary and Joseph both descended from David. Uh, but none of us have 24 chromosomes. Well, they knew. They told me before I asked them to, when I asked them to perform this investigation, that I had dried blood and you can't get a chromosome count on it because the white blood cells have to be alive and well in order to do that. You can get DNA, you can get some other things, but you can't have a chromosome count. So this blood is unique, <laughs> and it is Christ's blood. And that's With no explanations from Ron, the excavation suddenly came to a stop. On a later trip to Jerusalem, Ron entered the cave system alone through the middle door. And for the first time in quite a while, he re-entered the chamber with the Ark of the Covenant. To his utter surprise and disbelief, he found the chamber had been completely cleaned out and all the items from the temple were set up. No longer was the Ark in the stone case. The chamber where I found the Ark of the Covenant has since been perfectly cleaned out. And the Ark of the Covenant, the table of showbread, the candlestick, the golden altar of incense, they are all set out as they were in the earthly temple, except that the Ark of the Covenant is set, setting against the 12 foot long and 18 foot wide or high wall. He found the original tunnel was also cleaned out, and he followed it to discover that it did indeed open into Zedekiah's cave. It was not the tunnel he and his crew had opened earlier. In the following years, Ron entered the chamber with the Ark a number of times. Yes, the tables of stone were found in the Ark of the Covenant. I removed them with the assistance of four angels who lived in the mercy seat, which I would estimate weighs about 900 pounds of solid gold. And one of these angels told me to take the tables of stone out of there. He said, God wants everyone to see those. And so I took them out, backed up, stood there, frozen in place. And I, well, I just can't describe my physical state or mental state or anything else. If, if, you know, I didn't have some physical evidence to prove it happened, I think I had a dream or something. But anyway, they're on a stone ledge right in the same chamber. That's where the angel put them after I handed them to him. I didn't know what to do with them. And uh, I was told that these are to be presented with the blood evidence when the mark of the beast law is passed are enforced. Now, I know everybody wonders about what it is, the mark of the beast. You've heard all kinds of rumors, stories, and all of this. I'll tell you quick and simple. If you keep the Ten Commandments that God wrote upon those tables of stone, and about which he says in Psalms 89 and 34, those of you that are writing down text, you'll want this one. He says, My covenant will I not break, 
nor alter the thing that has gone out of my lips. He spoke the Ten Commandments from the mountaintop. He rolled them in stone with it. And he says, nothing will change. Right? If you keep that law, you will receive the seal of God. Soon there will be a set of man-made laws. These man-made laws will require that you break God's Ten Commandments. Christ said of the Pharisees, For it is in vain that they who worship me teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. If you keep those man-made laws and break God's Ten Commandments, you will receive the mark of the beast. 